will be familiar with the last problems that we had in August. And for us, sadly, still, the quest for democracy ends in blood. So I'm really, very really fortunate to be addressing people who have democracy, who are entitled to vote. But I don't think that having a right and exercising it is always the same. And in many ways I've been very disappointed by the great disinterest that people have had in voting because of the feeling that their vote will not count. My hope is that now we are on a pathway in which every vote will count and that it will be possible to have a system in which all the voices will be heard. The voices of minorities, and that includes, of course, Muslim minorities, to whom I belong, but also the voices of the people who have felt up to now that their vote didn't count. And I think that in terms of history in Britain, we are at a point when that possibility is imminent. What you need to do is fight for it. And so I think without fighting, you never get anything. Sometimes even with revolutions you don't, as I know. But I, I think you are lucky. And I think that for the first time ever, the government can hear you. And of course, there are many people in the House of Lords who support that too. Even though that would do me out of a job. But I still think it's very important for everybody to come. Thank you very much. Good luck and carry on.